Hi, my name is Vesna Novak and I will present to you automatic program repair in action by demonstrating a tool that automatically fixes code in industry code base. Big and modern tech companies have a large code base and software engineers in these companies work daily on developing software libraries and applications. Their work includes adding new features, improving performance and security, as well as fixing bugs. Tools that detect, localize and fix bugs or improve code in any way help software engineers in developing high quality, up-to-date software. In this video, I will give an overview of an automatic program repair tool developed and used by Bloomberg, the global finance, media and tech company. For more details, please check our paper on the introduction of automatic program repair in Bloomberg, published in the July-August 2021 special issue of IEEE Software Magazine about APR. The Bloomberg APR tool first finds existing fixes in the code base. Then it generates fixed patterns, that is the abstract representation of similar fixes scores and prioritizes fixed patterns according to the frequency of their past occurrence, and the output is a database of useful and frequent fixed patterns. Once a software engineer wants to check to see if some code is buggy or outdated, and if that code can be fixed automatically, this is the user interface that comes in handy. The user specifies the repository containing the code and selects the fix to be applied automatically from the list of supported fixes. The user selects, for example, a fix that is an update of a deprecated method with the signature 1 and triggers the pipeline. In the automated development workflow, the Bloomberg APR tool checks the repo for buggy or outdated code that can be fixed with the selected fix type. If buggy or outdated code is detected, the tool searches for an applicable fix pattern from the database. And finally, if a pattern is found, the tool applies the pattern and creates a pull request. The pull request contains the recommended fix. In this case, it is an insertion of a parameter in a method invocation. It also contains the description of the buggy or outdated code and how it was fixed, which helps the user understand and validate the PR. The user can either accept the PR and merge it into the main branch of the repository, or they can reject it. In both cases, the result is saved and sent to the APR team to further improve the APR tool. What kind of code can be fixed automatically? The Bloomberg APR, co uh, APR tool, built as part of this initiative, targets frequent, simple, buggy or outdated code. Simple, because the tool can learn how to fix them, and frequent, because automated fixes significantly reduce the time spent on manual code fixing. As with any other fixes, automatically generated fixes also improve the quality of the company's code base. One example of a simple and frequent outdated code relates to the usage of deprecated APIs. Although usages of deprecated APIs are not a typical software bug because they don't occur due to an error in a program, they are still important to fix to ensure the code is up to date and won't cause errors in your application. The deprecation of APIs is a consequence of software evolution. And whenever a software library is updated and its API is modified, older APIs are deprecated. A common change in an API is an insertion or a removal of a parameter or multiple parameters in a method invocation or renaming of a method, etc. The Bloomberg APR tool is able to learn and apply these updates automatically. Apart from the fixes learned from the past, this APR tool also employs static analysis tools such as Clank Tidy, which can detect uninitialized variables and suggest their initialization. Furthermore, software engineers can also provide their own fixes, 
which then become part of the database of fixes. The APR tool is then able to modify and apply them to fix new code. An example is a fix with a modified if statement. Instead of checking the return value of a method, the return value was compared with a defined constant value. Overall, with learned fixes and the fixes suggested by static analysis tools and software engineers, this APR tool set is able to provide a wide range of automated fixes to software engineers, saving their time and enabling them to focus their effort on far more interesting tasks than fixing bugs or updating code manually. If you want to learn more about this APR tool and potential collaboration options, please contact Serkan Kirbas, who is the software engineer leading the development of this tool in Bloomberg.